Here's how to solve Roman numeral problems. These can be pretty tricky. First, I'm going to start with the easier problems, and that is when we add only. Uh, all the conversions are written right down here, what each letter is representing. M is 1,000, so then C is 100, C is 100, L is 50, V is 5, and I is uh, 1. So you can see we had 1,000, we go down to 100, we go down to 50, we go down to 5, we go down to 1. The whole thing is downhill. And when you're going downhill, you're picking up speed. You're going faster and faster. And so we're only going to add these numbers together since we're only going downhill. So I put 1,000 plus 200s, 2 C's is 200s, plus 50, plus 5, plus 1. So that answer is 1,256. 5 plus 1 is 6. So 1,256 would be the answer. Now these are the trickier ones. This is where we're going to subtract and add in the same problem. C is 100. M is 1,000. I'm going up to 1,000 from C to M. L is 50. That's going downhill. I is 1. That's going downhill. X is 10. That's going up. From 1 to 10 is up. The two places where I go up, I want to circle those. I to X goes up, C to M goes up. The circled parts become subtraction problems. So we're going to reverse the numbers for these and make that a subtraction problem. C is 100, M is 1,000. I'm going to reverse that and put 1,000 first, minus 100. All right, and then I've got an L, that's equal to 50, so I'm going to add the 50. It's not, in, it's not circled here, it's not part of the two circled symbols. And then I'm going to add another part that gets subtracted. I've got 1 here and 10 here. I'm going to reverse those and make it 10 minus 1. What's all this equal to? 1,000 minus 100 is 900. 10 minus 1 is 9. And so I have 959 as my answer.